Hey guys, it's Erin. For the first nail, I'm going to be starting off with a white base, and then I'm going to be painting a chain of hearts down the center of my nail. Starting off with a dark pink, I'm doing a heart facing one direction, and then with my same small brush, I'm using a light pink to do a heart facing in the other direction. Keep repeating the hearts in opposite colors and facing the opposite directions to create the pattern. and finish with a top coat. For this next nail, I'm starting off with a light blue base. Then I'm gonna be painting a little heart balloon, so I'm starting off with a dark pink and just painting a heart shape towards the top of my nail. and adding a little triangle to the bottom of the heart for the tail of the balloon. Then I'm taking black acrylic paint and adding a string to the balloon and finishing with top coat. For my next nail, I'm starting off with a light pink base. And for this design, I'm gonna be painting a little Cupid's arrow. So I'm taking white acrylic paint and a small brush and painting a line diagonally down my nail. Then I'm adding the feathering to the end of one side of the arrow. Then with a darker pink and a dotting tool, I'm creating two dots at the top of the arrow and meeting them with a point to create a heart for the tip of the arrow. And of course, sealing it in with the top coat. This next design has a dark pink base. Then I'm gonna be painting a white envelope, so I'm taking a thin brush and painting a white rectangle in the center of my nail. Once I finish the rectangle, I'm taking that same dark pink I used as my base and adding lines to the details of the envelope. Do a larger triangle on the top and then two shorter lines on the bottom side of the envelope. Then I'm taking a light pink polish and a dotting tool and I'm creating a little heart in the center of the envelope. Finish this design with a top coat. For this design, I'm starting with a white base and then I'm gonna be creating an XO pattern. Between a shade of light pink and dark pink, I'm creating the X's and O's all across my nail in neat rows. An easy way to do circles for the O's is to start with a full filled in circle of the light pink for the O, and then later I'll go back in with white dots. Now that I've finished adding the X's and O's, I'm going back in on the O's with a white dot on top of the pink one to make perfect circles. And finish the design with a top coat. This nail has a dark pink base. And I'm going to be creating a little heart leopard print, so I'm taking a light pink and creating hearts to start my pattern. And then I'm filling in the rest of the space with just abnormal, slightly circular shapes that I would do for a regular leopard print. And going back in with the dotting tool and a black nail polish to outline the heart shapes and the circular shapes to make them look like a leopard print. Add in little bits of black dots to fill in any empty space and finish with a top coat. This next nail starts with a white base. And then I'm gonna be creating rows of hearts that go into a gradient pattern. So I'm starting off with the lightest pink at the top. And I'm doing two rows of each color. Now going in with a darker pink. And finally adding some deep red hearts to the bottom of my nail. And once you're finished, apply top coat. I'm painting my nail light blue for this one. 
And then I'm going to be creating a little candy heart message, so I'm taking a light pink and painting a big heart in the middle of my nail. Then with the dark pink, I'm very carefully doing the lettering for the candy heart. And super easy message for this one, I'm just writing love you. Finish the nail with the top coat. This next nail is a little Valentine's floral bouquet with a light pink base. And I'm just taking a darker pink and just doing three slightly rough circular shapes, then adding the green stems. And a little gold bow to tie the bouquet together. Next, I'm taking a white nail polish and just adding some messy C shapes to the flowers to just add some definition and detail for the petals. Finish with a top coat. And for this design, I'm painting my nail dark pink. Then I'm taking white nail polish or acrylic paint, and I'm going to be painting the letters to spell out love, except for the O. So keeping them in kind of a square shape, I'm painting the L, the V, and the E. And then with a light pink nail polish, I'm doing the O, but I'm making it in the shape of a heart. And finish with a top coat. And there you have all 10 cute and easy Valentine's Day nail designs. We really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more from Cute Polish, you can click the boxes here for more videos, or you can click the circle here to subscribe to Cute Polish for a new video every week. You can also click the circle here to subscribe to my personal nail art channel.